Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you track motion in Video Studio Pro X6. So first of all I'm going to insert my video clip which I want my motion to be tracked on and then after that you'll need either a title, an object or an overlay video to attach to the track motion. So first of all what we're going to do is we're going to track the path of the moving object in the video. So you need to click on this little button here and it says track motion. You'll then see that on your video there is this red circle and this is the area which is going to be tracked. So wherever you place that red marker that is what's going to be tracked when you press play. So mine is going to be tracking the end of this excavator. So now I've got it in the right place you then need to press track motion and you'll now see that it is tracking the path of the moving object in the video. So this will take a while if you've got a long video, otherwise it would be fairly short if for a shorter video. So you can see that mine is done, and the blue line is the line of the track motion. So now we can click OK, and you'll see that it's gone blue on the top there, which means it's got track motion on. So I'm now going to insert a title, and it's going to simply say, Track Motion Tutorial. Now it do, it's not relevant with the video, but for the purpose of this tutorial I'm just going to do it like this. So you can resize your text and then you can place it where you want. And then I'm going to place that in the overlay track. And then I'm going to make it the same size as the video track. I'm then going to right click on that and click match motion. Now you can then move your text to wherever you wish on the screen. I'm just going to put mine here. And then you can click OK. Now when you go back to the beginning of the video and press play, you should see that whatever it was that you wanted to be tracked, so for example the title or an object, you should see that it's following the moving object in your video in the place that you wanted it to be. As you can see with this, you can see that my title is following the excavator and it's going in all the places which I track the motion of. So that is just the basics of track motion. There are a few more things that you can do with this which I'll show you in the future in another tutorial. But that is just the basics like I said. And if you want any more videos like this or anything from PaintShop Pro or Video Studio then please do just write below. Or if you have any questions about this video then please feel free to comment and I'll get back to you as soon as possible.